Hey dudes and dudettes, uh, here again with another informational video for Path of Exile. This time it's going to be on a vendor recipe that can get you a Chaos or an Orb of Chance or multiples of those, or even higher levels of Regal Orb. Uh, it's basically a full suit of rares. <coughs> and I'll uh, explain that as I uh, sell them to the vendor. Uh, you have to have a complete full set of rares. And it, like I showed you before about the item level, I'll show you. See how that says 61? If they're all over 60, you get a chaos. If they're all under 60, 59 and under, you get an orb of chance. If they're above 75, you get a regal orb, which is quite a bit. Uh, but I'll, I'll show you that if you sell all these, see, it, it's going to get you three alteration, around four alteration and two alchemy shards on this set. But that's not near a chaos. It takes 20. 20 alteration orbs to get you a chaos. So as soon as we add the boots, we get a chaos. Uh, it has to be a full suit uh, in this uh, in the sense that helm, you know, chest, gloves, boots, belt, rings, amulet, and either a two-hand weapon, two uh, weapons for dual wielding, or a shield and a weapon. Uh, just basically, just like decking yourself out in rares. <coughs> Now, uh, if these are unidentified, if they're all unidentified, then it doubles the chaos. Or if they're all 20% quality, it doubles the, you know, it gives you two chaos. Just like, uh, and if they're all 20% and unidentified, you get three chaos. But that's not really worth it, because identifying your uh, rares is important, because late game, you can uh, get some pretty amazing rares that go for multiple chaos. So I just sell the ones, I, I stock back a whole suit, and I sell them for a chaos when I get them, because it's a, it's a huge profit boost. I hope this video helped you, and I hope it uh, gets more of you making currency. Uh, as always, be cool to each other, and take care of yourselves.